how to use keeper hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can use keeper so having said that let's just jump into the video now i just want to say that for those of you who don't know what keeper is keeper is basically a you know a protector for your computer it's like uh you know and removes files and secures them in a locked folder so you know you can keep your privacy so having said that let's just jump into the video now first things first what we're going to do is we're just simply going to go ahead and sign up now it's not free but you can try it for free for a limited time and then you can go ahead and buy it so over here as you can see keeper protects organizations against crypto against cyber threats with zero trust and zero knowledge and stuff like that so it's pretty amazing so let's go ahead and sign up and use it so but first let me just show you the pricing plans so over here these are some of the pricing plans that you can see so there's keeper unlimited there's keeper family so over here uh it secures store unlimited passwords this is for the ultimate generates an autofill strong password store identity and payment info login with fingerprints and face id and use and access unlimited devices there are a bunch of other features but you can go ahead and check them out and then we have the keeper family it has unlimited password storage 10 gigabytes secure file storage unlimited identity and payment storage secure record sharing and more so it's pretty simple and if we come over here onto the pricing plans we can see we have enterprise business or personal if we click on the personal one it's going to take us over here where we have the personal plan so over here we can choose either the family plan or the you know the personal one so for the personal one the ultimate is going to have all these different stuff and for the plus bundle we're going to have like 4.7 it's going to be like 4.87 dollars and it gives you unlimited password management breach watch which you know monitors dark web and secure file storage and a bunch of different more so let's get started so first i'm going to go back over here and i'm just simply going to click on try it for free and over here we choose which type of option we want so individuals and family msps or organizations i'm going to choose individuals and families right i want to keep myself secure and over here we enter in our password get protected and then we click on next and then we just set a master password and then we confirm the master password and then we just simply click on next then we just enter in the verification code that they're going to send us into our email address so over here as you can see this is the verification code just simply copy it just simply copy it and go back over here and paste it and click on next and boom we are good to go so we can go ahead and do this later and skip it but for now i think we are good to go so over here this is going to be your vault all right in this vault you're going to have all of your records over here on the left side you have identity and payments and over here you can set up identity and payment options you have secure audit where you can see all of your passwords you have breach web which gonna you know monitor dark web and stolen usernames and passwords that match and then you have deleted items as well and then you have secure add-ons that you can add over your uh you know on your account such as keeper chat which will private hyper secure messaging breach watch to protect yourself from dark web keeper family plan which protects and preserves your family legacy secure file storage keeper for business and concierge services as well and then of course we have my wallet now if you wanted to create a new wallet all you got to do is simply click on create new you simply create a folder or payment card or shared folder right so let's go ahead and add the folder and i'll just say uh you know over here the folder name is going to be uh privates right and then just simply click on create and then we have our folder and we can go ahead and add some records over here so if we click on the option button we can change the color and move it and stuff like that so i'm going to choose and the color and change it to red yeah i think that's good and then over here we can add different products right so for example let's just take this video for example and i'll just drag and drop and upload it over here we have the file attachment all right so it says it's too large it has to be a you know limited to 100 mbs per second so we can upload that but uh over here let's go ahead and choose photos instead and over here i'll just choose files or photos and i'll just choose this simple photo right here and it's uploading over here and then we can add some notes and titles and i can be like you know new shoe or whatever you know i want and then i just simply click on save and then my file will be saved within this folder as well so over here we can edit it as well we can add privates and all of that and of course no one can access this uh you know folder unless someone 
you know, has your password to it and you can create and secure a lot of things. So other things that you can do is you can add like, you know, your card and your payment stuff. So you can add like your own personal uh, options over here, you know, your personal information, your username, you can add your phone number address and you can add your payments over here. You can add in your card title, you know, your card number and holders and all of that so that it can be secured so that even if someone, you know, gets a hold of your card, you know, you can go ahead and keep it secure over here. So no one, you know, tries to hack you or anything. So pretty simple, nothing too crazy. You just simply sign up onto this website. You know, you create an account, you create a folder, and then you upload your files over it, as you can see. So it's pretty simple. And of course, you will have your deleted items over here. This is going to be your trash bin over here. And then, of course, you have your secure add-ons as well. And over here, you can also get a extension for this as well. So if you come over here onto Google and you just simply search for, you know, go over to the extension store. And you can go ahead and install an extension for this software as well. So if you go over to Google and search for the extension in the extension store. So over here, I'm on the Chrome store and I just simply search for, let's say, Keeper. And I search for Keeper Security. Um, it's not over here. Then let me just see where I can find it. So for that, what you're going to do is, you know, go back over here. I mean, it wasn't available on the store. So I guess it's on the uh, website as well. So if I come over here underneath products and you will see you have the option to download the app, you click on that button, you click on that button and it's going to take you over here where you can see your uh, password manager. So there's password management or private messaging. You can go ahead and download the Windows um, option over here or on phone or on mobile or for the password management you can go ahead and you know download it for your windows or for chrome as well so well, you can just simply click on install chrome and then you can find the keepers password management option um, then you just simply click on add to chrome and it's going to add the extension onto your chrome and then you can go ahead and you know access it whenever you want and doing this will enable you to secure any password that you enter on any website it'll automatically detect it and you know secure it and ask you if you want to keep it in the locker or vault so yeah and pretty much that's it so having said that that is it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions or come across any problem whatsoever then let me know in the comment sections down below and I'll be sure to help you out in any way I can as soon as possible. And also, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel and also turn on the bell notification as you'll get notifications every time we post a new video. Your support to the channel means a lot and also share this video with your friends and family members if they enjoy this type of content and would like to know how to make money online or just simply want to know how a particular software or website works. We post these types of videos daily, so you don't have to worry about running out of content. You will get new content every single day, so don't worry about it. So having said that, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next video, and until next time, take care and goodbye.